Donald Trump appears to double down on comments he made in the Access Hollywood tape during his videotaped deposition in the civil case over allegations he raped author E. Jean Carroll in a Manhattan dressing room in the 1990s. NBC News correspondent Ron Allen described the testimony as raw and graphic Friday during an appearance on MSNBC with Katie Turr in which several legal analysts said they believe Trump's testimony is a blow to his legal case. He insults Miss Carroll, he calls her a whack job sick, a nut job even attacks and is disparaging of the attorney, the female attorney, that was questioning him saying that you wouldn't be on my list either in the context of someone who we would want to be involved with, put it that way, Allen said, noting that Trump denies the allegations. It's just it's very raw. It's very graphic. It's very, it's you know, it's, very striking. Especially striking was a segment from the deposition in which an attorney representing Carol reads the former president's own words from the Access Hollywood tape. I just start kissing them. It's like a magnet. Just kiss. I don't even wait. And when you're a star, they let you do it. You can do anything. Grab them by the expletive, attorney Roberta Kaplan asks Trump during the deposition. That's what you say, correct? Trump replies, well historically that's true with stars. It's true that they can grab women by the expletive? Kaplan asks him. Well if you look over the last million years, that's been largely true. Not always, but largely true. Unfortunately or fortunately, Trump said. Tur played the segment twice. It happens quickly, but realize he has just said fortunately, when asked about the ability to grab women, he has said fortunately or unfortunately, what part of that is fortunate, MSNBC legal analyst Laura Jarrett said. Legal analyst Danny Ceballos appeared stunned hearing Trump, saying, as far as I know, for the first time doubling down on what he said in the Access Hollywood tape, whereas before he called it locker room talk. He apparently believes every word that he said many years ago that was that were caught on tape. So, this I think is very troubling to see this on video. It's got to be terrific for the plaintiff.